ECOWAS Commission says it has met with the ECOWAS Early Warning Response Network to review and improve its monitoring tool system for conflict prevention. Mrs. Finda Kuruma, Vice President of the ECOWAS Commission, at the opening of the ECOWAS Ministerial Workshop in Abuja, said that the Commission invited professionals to review the system after 11 years of operation. According to her, gathering analysis, dissemination and sharing of data are essential to reduce the time required to make decisions and respond to security risk. For us at the Commission, the success of this meeting will help to promote peace and security in our member states. This holds true because an effective conflict prevention and management tool resulting from this evaluation exercise would be one of the best assets and tools a regional economic community like the ECOWAS Commission can have at its disposal to protect its member states and population from threats both external and internal. As you already know, ECOWAS collects processes and manages data and information for analysis and disseminates reports that are then used for decision making by the ECOWAS Commission and the ECOWAS Heads of State and Government. This regional solidarity mechanism has enabled us to up to date to prevent and mitigate many threats to human security. It has served to ease tensions in the region and facilitate the implementation of response measures in many countries such as the Gambia, Mali, Guinea-Bissau, and many others. Mrs. Yvonne Akwasom, Head of Conflict Prevention, GIS EPSIO Programme, said that preparing ahead of any conflict was the best way to prevent it. Akwasom expressed delight at the opportunity to collaborate with ECOWAS on the project. In looking at the workshop objectives and expected results as set out uh, by the ECOWAS Commission, it is clear that it is very relevant or necessary to look at the regional systems and mechanisms for early warning and response. And in this regard, amongst other critical aspects, the workshop aims to exchange within this distinguished group an assessment on how best to improve the ECOWAN system. And it also hopes to position the ECOWAN model as the lead early warning data management tool in ECOWAS member states. I represent here today a new four-year program that supports the ECOWAS peace and security architecture and operations. In short, we call it EPSAO. It is jointly co-funded by the European Union and the German Ministry for Economic Development and Cooperation and supports three strategic areas as relates to conflict prevention actions, such as the ones we are considering here over the next two days, as well as actions to improve ECOWAS's planning and readiness for peace support operations. And lastly, actions to support the implementation of the 2016 ECOWAS security sector reform and governance policy framework.